Hey, thanks for dropping in to check out my video. Be sure to check my description. I do have quick shortcut links in there to jump to whatever point you want to see in the video so you don't have to watch all of my rambling between. But it is June 28th. Let's see what they give us today. Oh, more new stuff. Oh my god. <laughs> There is new stuff coming out every single day. I guess 14 days of summer, right? That's what it is. Oh my god. A tent? A camping tent? Oh my god, that's hilarious. I love it. Is it little kissy mark pillows? Those pillows look funny. They look like... I don't know what they're making me think of. Like little piglets or like cow udders or something they're making me think of something funny but that's hilarious that is very unique and original I'm telling you right now wow that's pretty cool it's his now part of the bigfoot set all right you are mine now camp cruiser get in my locker and then bigfoot oh my god he exists it's true <laughs> he looks so grumpy Get off my lawn. What's his back bling? Oh my god. Ugh, what? Is that fish sticks? Get out of here, Bell. Don't text me when I'm doing a review. God! I sw I'm pretty sure that's fi fish sticks arm in there. Oh my god, Bigfoot was eating fish sticks. Oh, when you shake it, stuff falls out of it. Oh, that's pretty cool. It actually, like, throws it really far, too. Huh. Interesting back bling. I don't know how versatile that's going to be. That is in the troll category for a back bling, for sure. But, I mean... Oh, this skin... Actually, it's all brown. It's going to blend in this stuff really well. It's, like, another version of the army skins, because it's, like, a total brownish color. So, it'll blend in pretty good, actually. So, all right. Uh, Bigfoot, you are mine now. Get in my locker. Um, okay, and savor the W, a new emote. Let's hope it's good. Ooh. Ooh. A counter to the L. This is... This is a catchy beat. Oh, kind of did something weird there. All right. Savor the W. You are mine now. That, that's a cool emote. I like that emote. That's good. That's good. Although, I'm very curious. Um, I got to see this. Oh, my God. <laughs> Look at that smile. That bright, curly whiteies. Is it okay? Is it, am I just exaggerating it with her, or do other skins have as pearly whiteies? No, it's not nearly as noticeable. And we are back again in my new island, which is a reason why I was so delayed with everything today. So I'm way behind, I'm trying to get caught up. Uh, I'm going to make this quick. Um, let's take a look at the glider. Whoops. Alright. So on deploy. You can hear them zip open all the flaps there. They kind of all flap around a little bit. Let's go backwards. Left. Right. Doesn't really make much noise, so it's really quiet see the pillows inside kind of flap in the wind a little bit so does the uh, sleeping bag kind of cool let's do one more oh zips up when you put it away what you can hear there all right deploy and it zips right open those pillows look like I don't know they remind me of like piglets or like cow udders I don't know why they have little kisses on them Looks like a bit of vision loss, though. Like, it's covering up almost those whole three buildings right there in front of me. So if I was trying to land on a gun on top of this blue building, uh, I'd be... Yeah, I'd have to look a different angle for sure. 
Okay, let's do the ADS test with him. Uh, let me turn my camera off here. Okay. So, let's test it here with the back bling on. So I look over at this red square here. Um, we can see the back bling cuts off that one at the bottom over there. Half of the one above it. Um, so not too, too bad. So we lose one and a half there. So I think we're looking at, what, is that a 12, 12 and a half score? Without a back bling. You can see that he sees about 13. And there's a couple halves that come in. Uh, the one by his arm is kind of almost all cut off. Um, so his arm's a little fat. The one by his eyebrow disappears and comes in a little bit. But a quarter of it. And the one above his head there, you can see half of it and it goes away after a bit. So 13 plus, let's say, two halves. So he gets a 14. Um, I'm going to phase in the Scully ADS that could see a perfect 20. Just so you can compare. Um, and you'll see that uh, where he's lacking, which is around his head area, obviously. He blocks most of them at the truck and over the archway, um, things like that. So, uh, And the one between his face and his gun, you can't see anything there. It blocks the whole thing because, you know, he's a big, big old fat yeti. For standing without a back bling, we can see 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, uh, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, about 13. 13 out of 20. One of them kind of like comes in a little bit and goes out as he uh, wheezes in and out. Yeah. Let's just say 12 and a half then. Because he kind of makes it disappear every once in a while. Yeah. Or actually, even that, if I move a little bit, it blocks that other one to his, uh, by the back bling there. It's kind of visible, but it kind of goes away. Yeah, I don't know. It's like between 8 and 9. Between 8 and 9, actually. That's pretty low. Between 8 and 9 on the standing with a back bling. Dang. Uh, yeah. 8 to 9 on standing with a back bling. That's really bad. He's really big. Like, his head and stuff is really big. So, you do lose quite a bit there. Skin looks really cool, though. Um, the back bling is really cool. It's interactive. Ice comes out of it as you jump around. The little fish sticks arm flaps around. The it says jammies on it. Writing is jammies. They kind of flop around inside. So it's kind of cool. It's a troll back bling though. I don't know how many other skins you're going to be able to match this back bling with. You're really only going to use it if you want to have a troll outfit. For sure. But his color is super camouflaged, like with wood. Look at this. He like matches this wood barrier almost exactly in color. And his whole face is the same color as well. So he's kind of like a Yeti version of the toy trooper skins. Because they're green and gray and he's brown. So now we have a green, a gray, and a brown camo outfit. Just this one has a bit of ADS loss is all. But all right, let's check out the back blings on him. So I looked through a bunch of back blings. He actually matches a lot. And the thing that makes me pretty happy is that he matches a lot of back blings that I don't really use a lot. So I'm going to showcase a lot of those back blings. There are still some I'm going to show that are, are regulars. But there's a lot in here are ones that I usually don't ever use that he looks really good with. So uh, let's start. Um, we're going to look at all right, Assassin's Pack. Obviously, this one goes on a lot. It looks good. Bamboo. I like it. It's really cool on him. Um, yeah, I dig it. Uh, enduring cape. This is another. This is one I don't really use. It actually kind of looks okay on him just because his textures are very similar to that cape. And the colors kind of blend in. Like, they're neutral, so they work. Uh, frozen Shroud. This cape looks good on him as well. Um, we're going to go with Mutiny. This one obviously looks good. It's the same kind of color. Uh, both the molten crested cape and the regular crested cape look pretty decent on him. Uh, padlock looks really good. Uh, here it is, padlock. Color kind of blends in as well, looks good. Uh, wolf pack, of course, looks good. 
And now we're going to get into the ones that I don't show a lot. Uh, Arcanum. I kind of like it. It's like he's a crazy mad Bigfoot. And the color blends in and the green's a nice kind of accent. Um, backboard is one I show, but the food one looks really good on him. The colors kind of look good against his skin. Uh, Bird Hovel. I did this show this one with the shadow uh, uh, skins, but uh, it looks good on him. Uh, Battle Mask. This one looks good on him. Uh, Clue Finder. This guy here. This one looks good. Uh, Crafted Carrier. This one I never really put on skins, but it actually looks pretty decent on him. I dig it. I, I like it. Uh, Dodger, the pet. The camo version. Looks really good. Really, really good. Uh, we're going to go with Fabled Cape. Kind of fits the, the theme with the big bad wolf. He's a Bigfoot, but he kind of looks a little like a werewolf in the same sense, too. So he's like a cross, I think. Um, Emblazoned Buckler. Uh, this one looks really good. Uh, both of the gingerbreads look good. I'll show the other one when we get to it. Uh, Go Bag, the tan version. Looks really good. Uh, Nana Cape, the banana cape. Uh, here's the other gingerbread. Same thing, just a brown face. N banana Cape, looks really good. Uh, the Merry Munchkin pet, looks good. Uh, runic Shield, this guy here. This one looks good. Uh, Spellbinder, this one looks really good. Really good. Uh, trash Lid, because he's a trash, you know, I don't know, trash Bigfoot goes through trash. Sure. <laughs> uh, Tomb Pouch. Uh, Woodsy, the default version of Woodsy looks pretty decent. Uh, banana bag. Barrel and booty. Looks good. This has been coming up a lot lately, but it matches his skin pretty well. Looks good. Uh, pair of provisions. Do, do, do. Here. Pair of provisions. Pineapple strummer. Puncture pack. Uh, road ready. Uh, seaworthy. Saltwater satchel. Oh, this is saltwater. This is saltwater satchel. Sorry. Seaworthy is here. I did them backwards, but they were both part of my list, so it's okay. Uh, spike chamber. I never use this one. Uh, vintage. Um, a couple troll ones that I liked. Um, I liked haystacks. I thought it was kind of troll. Spirit cape. I thought Spirit Cape actually looks really kind of cool from the back, but it's super red and pink, so it's totally a troll cape. Uh, Brat Bag, it's up at the top, so I think that's pretty troll. I like it. Um, Uzi, I kind of like this too, as like a troll one. So, you know, a Bigfoot with a squirt gun. Looks kind of good. Uh, if you want to see his back bling on a couple of the newer skins, like... Uh, uh, like it really turns any skin into like a trolly looking skin, you know. Uh, it kind of looked okay on this guy, but it still looks trolly on the dog. And Demi. I mean, it kind of blends in with the red version, but whoops, on him, on him, yeah. On the red one, it looks okay, I guess. Like, I don't know. It's one of those back blings that... You know that you're only going to use it when you want to be... Oh, it looks like matches color-wise on her. But it's still it's still troll. It still looks troll. Um, yeah. I don't know. Like, it doesn't even really look good on him. It's just troll. That's all it is. It doesn't really like, match him. Oh, yeah, on fish sticks, though. <laughs> there you go. 
It looks better on fish sticks than it looks on the Bigfoot, to be honest with you. But it's kind of like sadistic. He's a cannibal. He's cannibalizing his own kind. I hate you. Okay. Anyhow, <laughs> obviously I am tired. Uh, what's left? Okay, we got to review this stuff. So, Bigfoot. Design and details. Um, I like it. I think he's cool. Uh, yeah. He's uh, quite original. I mean, there's the Yeti from the other uh, battle pass, but um, it's not a Yeti. It's a Bigfoot. Come on. Let's be real here. It was very versatile. I found a lot that matched with him. Uh, he's not getting a good ADS score, though. Nope, nope, nope. Bad ADS score. Back bling. It is original. I'm going to give it that. Oh, and the design is actually... I'll give it the design. It is a pretty cool design. It's very interactive. A lot going on with it. One thing I will say, though, because it's so interactive and it's flopping around and stuff's coming out of it, it is a little bit distracting when you're in-game. So if you're getting in a, in a fight, it might distract you a little bit. Like, I find that with pets sometimes. Sometimes pets distract me. I feel like this back bling might be a little distracting, but it's not versatile at all. It's a troll back bling. You put it on when you want to be a troll. That's it. It doesn't look good on a lot of stuff. So, And again, the ADS score was not great. It didn't help with the ADS score. It took off... Um, uh, back bling, you mean we lost? Well, on the standing point, we lost four points from it. So, yeah. Uh, not getting ADS score for back bling. Cost rarity, I think it's fair. Comes with a back bling. It's just a rare. If they made it an epic, it could be no way. Um... And I mean, I like it. I think it's a cool skin. Um, on its own, I don't care for the back bling very much. It's just troll. Whatever. But the skin, I like it. Um, I don't like that you lose ADS, but I like that it's a whole solid color of brown. It's going to be super camo. So it'll be able to blend into the environment pretty well. Um, I like the toy soldier skins way more than this guy. But I, I don't hate him. I think he's kind of cool. He's just a little bit bulky. A little bulky. Um, so my man will get a 7 out of 10 for the Bigfoot. Alright, looking at the Camp Cruiser, design is actually good. I like the design. It looks cool. It's very original. I mean, it's a flying tent. Come on. Um, details and effects. I mean, there's not a lot. Well... Okay, the gliding there's no gliding effects i'm gonna give it for the itself its details and effects are pretty decent like it looks got good details you know everything's flopping around everything's moving it's kind of interactive so that's cool but it's not very versatile it's a troll glider once again deploy sound it's kind of cool it's got like the the zipping noise there is no gliding sound at all um there is no gliding effects at all gameplay vision loss it's got some vision loss Cost to rarity. I mean, uncommons. Most of the uncommon gliders are just the standard battle glider with different changes to it. Um, there's really not any that are super different like this, so I want to say it's fair. Um, would I recommend buying this? Not really. Unless you want a troll glider, there's nothing crazy special about it. Um, so I'm going to give the Camp Cruiser a 5 out of 10. 5 out of 10, modest in the middle score. You get what you, you get. What you get. Like, don't expect much from it. It's, it's a flying tent. So, yeah, 5 out of 10 for the Camp Cruiser. But... Savor the W? This, this emote's a W. It's pretty cool. I like it. It's popping. It's got a nice upbeat... You know, a nice like, upbeat tune to it. I like it. This 10 out of 10 for the emote. It's great. Emote is 10 out of 10. Emote is great. The emote's probably the best thing that was in the shop today, for sure, by far. Emote was really cool. Um, that's it for today. Um, yeah, I uh, put out three videos today because I was catching up. I finished my island today, so it was a big day today. Plus, I had work. Shoot me now. Anyhow, thanks for coming, checking it out. Please drop a like. Please subscribe. Leave a comment. Um, yeah, and I'll, I'll see you soon, guys. I really appreciate all this initial support. Um, yeah, take care of yourself. Have a good night. 
And uh, if you are celebrating a long weekend this weekend like me, just don't go too crazy, but enjoy yourself, okay? See you later.